turn on your notification bell you will still get those information you are looking for our new methodology will produce results but remain discreet onyendu encouraged us that's maze or barista finding job for you know giving updates on the routine visit to maze namdekanu onyendu himself let me quote him now it's very important the court order routine visit to our indefatigable client onyendu maze namdekanu was conducted today at the dss headquarters abuja where onyendu is still being held in solitary confinement the visit was still conducted today in strict adherence to the new DSS protocol introduced to distort the status quo. Oyendu was comprehensively briefed on the holistic legal approach being adopted to secure his unconditional release. All T's have been crossed and I's dotted, thereby setting the stage ripe for the main business of the 11th day of October 2022 to proceed unhindered. We are doing all that is legally permissible to ensure that the outing will be recorded as a fruitful one. Onyendu is profoundly enthused by the line of actions as itemized towards achieving the desired and best results, which he classified as top-notch. We wish to retweet that confining Onyendu in a solitary space is no doubt a grave infraction of his rights and an established act of torture clearly spelled out on that our laws and which Violation is no doubt aimed at breaking his spirit. Nonetheless, Onyendu remains very strong in his conviction as he has defied every strategy adopted by, adopted by the state to break him. He is resolute and uncompromisingly firm. Self-determination is a right recognized under our laws and other international laws and instruments. Onyendu was particularly enthused after he was fully briefed on the news of the release of Umar Biafra. He could not hold his excitement on hearing the long-awaited news. He thanked me in particular and my legal team for our outstanding professionalism that has always guided our strategy towards rescuing Omochineke, detained in various facilities of the Nigerian security agencies. Our new methodology, which will always remain discreet, is a compelling one and result-oriented, and Onyendu encouraged us to keep up the good work. Now that Mama Biafra has been released, pursuant to an application for the enforcement of her fundamental rights I had earlier fired on her behalf, we shall continue with the suit to ensure that she is adequately compensated for the period of time she was unlawfully detained in solitary confinement. We wish to assure Mochineke that we are not leaving any stone unturned towards ensuring that all those still languishing in custody are released. Idara Gold and others are in our top priority. As our team are aggressively pursuing their release, please be assured that it shall all end in praise. Omu Chineke, Onyendu extended his sincere regards and love to you all, Omu Chineke, while soliciting for your continued unrelenting prayers and support. Thank you all, Ezebo Omu Chineke, and remain blessed. Even as you continue to remain law abiding, we appreciate you all. We move. That is Sir Ifanya for Esquire. IPOB's late council. So, 1st September 2022, unquote. So, this is the statement. This is my Balestifan Ejofo's statement on the on his routine visit or the routine visit to Mazi Namdekano. Yes. So, that is it. Mazi is excite, excited for hearing the news of uh, the release of Mohamed Biafra. We have been saying it about uh, Mazi's um, make of women kindness and his belief that all the Biafrans who have been detained illegally, of course, there's no Biafran person or agitator that has been detained today that, you know, that is not unlawfully detained. Yes, nobody have done anything wrong. Nobody, unless you are not being detained on account of Biafra agitation. If by genuinely and it is being proven that you are merely agitating for free freedom, and referendum for Biafra, and you are caught and arrested and you are being detained, you shouldn't worry. There's no cause for alarm. You shouldn't, you know, worry yourself much. Yes, you are not like other prisoners, criminals, elements. No. You have to hold your head high. Yes. You are fighting a just cause. You are fighting a just cause. The families should know that they have produced the hero. Any person, any family, 
you have your family, you have your person in detention today because he's fighting the cause of Biafra. You have to be proud of yourselves. Family members, please, be proud of yourselves. You have a hero. You have a hero. Do not dis don't be dis don't be dis don't despair. Don't despair. Don't feel dis dispirited or resent to fate. No. You have to hold your head high. You are he you have produced heroes. Yes, true, they're in detention facilities. It doesn't diminish the fact that they are heroes. They are heroes. Yes. Yes, Mazenarokan is chatting a course that today we have people who are stout, who are determined, who are brave enough to confront the present day realities, to confront the present day adversaries, enemies of pro 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 progress and prosperity, enemies of freedom and liberty. Yes. And we have the hero of all heroes in Mazenam de Kano. Yes. Is the hero of all the heroes. He's leading, others are following. And today he said yes, he's particularly, you know, excited for Mama for Mama Biafra's release. And so Mazi has been each time such news is broke, you know. So Mazi always feel happy and excited. So he said we should continue in our prayers. If Mazi Khan is not, you know, if they didn't if the federal government have not succeeded in breaking his spirit, which they are targeting. I think it should give us the impetus to pray more fervently for Mazinam Dekano, yes, who is the hero of all the heroes. Yes, we have many heroes in the Biafra land. We have said it. Do anybody language intention facility because you are fighting a just cause of freedom for referendum for Biafra? You are a hero. You are a hero. And uh, that is what we are saying today. So Mazinam Dekano have said it, that we should continue in prayers. We should be unrelenting in our prayers. And it's very important. He, 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 he never forgets to appreciate Amuchineke for their support, their prayers and everything. That appreciation is very paramount. It goes a long way to show his person. Yes, we have said it. The make of human kindness flows in this hero of our time. Yes, the make of human kindness flows out. Despite the fact he's a determined person, he's a dogged fighter, He's a colossus, he's an icon. Yes, Martin Namdekano is, is someone who fights and fights with all the strength in him. Yes, he does not have any reservation when he's fighting for a just cause. Yes, he's stout. He's stout. Yet, he has this make of human kindness. He's resolute when he set out to achieve a cause. And that is it. And so, yet, he has this empathy, compassion for people who have been oppressed. And that compassion and empathy is what led, led him into this journey of liberation, journey of freedom, freeing his people from the captivity of the enemy, of the adversary, of the ancient serpent. And